So a new slate of videos came out from Samsung poking fun at Apple. Some of my guys at Android Authority think they are cringeworthy. I think they're pretty funny, but I'm also into dad jokes. So what do you call a bee that gives milk? A booby. Like when one customer asked why the iPhone 10 doesn't have micro SD expansion support. Forget this guy, buy this guy. Oh. It's just $140 more. <laughs> So, we doing this, or...? Or when another customer confirms that the Galaxy S9 has a faster download speed than the iPhone X, the Genius Bar person can only say... Well, no, but it is faster than the iPhone 8. But the download speeds aren't faster than the Galaxy S9. Mm. But I thought it was the smartphone of the future. Look, um... But unlike my coworker Oliver at Android Authority who wrote this article, I do not think these videos are cringeworthy. I think they're hilarious. But I'm 45 years old and may have a different taste than you do. However, the big point here is that the vast majority of iOS devotees do not care about the spec bumps on the Galaxy S9. They don't. They're like my 16 year old daughter. If it's not an iPhone, it doesn't matter. She doesn't want it. She doesn't care that the camera's better. She doesn't care that it's faster. She doesn't care that it has expandable storage. She doesn't care. What she wants is the little Apple logo on her phone. Moving on to news regarding the S Pen from the Galaxy Note 9. It could have some funky features. New renders of the Galaxy Note 9 in purple and blue have surfaced online, but we've also seen leaks of a new Samsung wireless charger that will be able to simultaneously charge the Galaxy Note 9 and the upcoming Galaxy Watch. The leaked image comes from Roland Quant on Twitter, who shows off the product in retail packaging. New information about the S Pen for the Galaxy Note 9 and its remote functionality has been discovered. XDA developers dug into the Air Command app located in the leaked Samsung Tab S4 firmware. Inside, they found several code strings that hint at some of the stylus remote functionality. Here are some of the claimed features of the upcoming S Pen. Control music by pressing the S Pen's soul button, remote camera shutter button, ability to turn on the Note 9's display and unlock the handset as long as the S Pen was removed from the phone before it was locked, an option for third-party app integration, long press the S Pen's button for launching a specific app, and potentially customizable actions for single and double presses of the S Pen's button. Those are all things that power users are going to love and that phone is really about power users. Let me know what you think about the S Pen's features in the comments below. Wait, 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 I got another one. No, no, you can't, you can't tell jokes about a woman's PMS, period. <laughs> one more thing before we go, guys, I wanted to give a heartfelt shout out to our number one fan, Christian Prodan. Christian, I'm gonna send you one of these. I don't know if it's gonna look exactly like this, but I'm sending you a t-shirt. Take care, buddy. Bye. <laughs>